points for the bonus zones or bonus areas. Clap! Whoa! Star power! Woo! And that's not gonna be nearly enough, even if I got all the star points. Remember, collect the flowers as they appear. And whoa! Beautiful! Clap, 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 clap. And yeah, when you're near them, you can kill them. Ow! That was just mean of you, ninja monkey. Yes, that is a ninja monkey on top of that warthog thing, whatever. That was just mean. It tag team the I didn't stand the chance. And vine, vine, and upsy daisy. Wall kick, wall kick, and clap, and we're going down. And bounce. Wait, can I get? Okay. Now get on there. Yes, stand the lions for the win. God, that is the biggest dandelion I've ever seen in my life. Come on, flower, power, oh shoot. I could have got more flowers out of that if I would have fell down. Ah, boobers. <laughs> I, I didn't make it in time. And jump, clap, whatever kind of flower that is. It looks like a drain on top of a stick. I don't know what the heck that is. <laughs> and clap, remember, don't touch the walls with your hellabird. Otherwise, you'll lose your hellabird. And look at the combo that I have around Donkey Kong. That, oh man, I could really get some points if I did this here. Come on, Kong. Get it in position. Get in position. Clap, 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 clap. Yeah, baby. <laughs> and they ran out. Oh well. And get on the. There we go. Oh man, why, why did I. Oh. It's because I, I forgot about the clap sensitivity that I adjusted. I gotta clap harder. Because it was accidentally triggering as a clap when I was doing just regular old bongo hits. And I can't let that happen. Next boss is another type of hog. And you remember how to beat the hogs, right? So he's a whitish albino type of hog. This is a mohawk. Well, obviously a play on the word mohawk because of his hairdo. That is some fuzzy hairdo, I gotta say. Alright, I like how you can see like every hair on there. It's a nice little detail. But of course it doesn't really affect gameplay. It's just something nice. And uh, yeah, same as the other Warthog basically, except the platforms are slightly set differently and he gets a lot more ornery or a lot faster. And uh, oh! <laughs> He's also got that thingy that you have to dodge. I forgot about that. Oh, oh, he really shot that one at me. He's also got that charge attack thing. And he also shoots very quickly, evidently. <laughs> and otherwise, he's the same old warthog that we know and love. And you're gonna shoot your... Oh, it's a spiky thingy. Go away, spiky thingy. Oh, no. I got close to him. He did, when you touch him, he doesn't hit you. It's his attacks that hurt you. Which actually makes sense for once. Because usually, it's something... You know, it has to do with... Uh, just an enemy touching you, which finally makes sense in gaming. I mean, if something touches you, it won't hurt you, right? But if an attack hurts you, of course it's gonna hurt you. <laughs> it's just like when Mario runs right into a Goomba or something like that, and he gets hit even though the Goomba's just minding his own business, he's just walking along and Mario takes a hit if he walks into him. <laughs> Makes no sense whatsoever. But anyway, kingdom clear. I got a silver medal. I didn't quite reach to 800 for gold. And hint video. Uh, I guess I could have. Huh, maybe I could have collected enough flowers around that area. Well, I missed the flower bonus anyway, which is kind of sad. Which is probably where my uh, um, gold medal went to. Uh, Pineapple Kingdom. I love pineapples. They are juicy. But I don't like their cores. I hate cutting them up. <laughs> They're just a cumbersome to cut up and get rid of all those little things. You know, those little pits that are in them. Ah, I could rant about that fruit all day, but it's so delicious that I have to forgive it. <laughs> and clap, and jump. My combo's getting dang high. And I think I'm gonna get another combo for this flower right here. Oh no, I didn't, but I will get it for this warthog. Woo! And give me some bananas, and clap to get up here. Clap it up here, my combo continues. Can keep the combo going, I'm still in the air. And to control when you're in a bubble, you continuously float up no matter what you do. So you've got to control yourself by going left and right. I don't think you can pop the bubble either, if I'm not mistaken. So just go slowly, go carefully. I'm pretty sure. Can I, oh, I guess you can pop the bubble, okay. 
they will eventually pop themselves if I'm not mistaken, so uh, make sure you rejuve your bubble at any time that you can, and wow, I've got a 350 combo. I do not want to lose this combo, because that's a lot of points and life energy. Uh, what's up higher? What's up higher? There's a B. I do not like that B. Ah, there's my combo. Clap, clap, clap. Goodbye, fishy or froggy or whatever. And there's my pineapple. Take a bite out of that, DK. And that's the end of the stage. Well, Rumble Falls at least. Next up is the Pristine Sea, but I'm afraid we're running low on time in this part, so I think what I'm gonna... Well, I'll, I'll get a little bit of little bit of stuff done. What the heck? Those butterflies give you some uh, points there. Okay, to control uh, a swimming underwater, when you hit a bongo, you swim downwards. Keep that in mind. If you don't hit a bongo, you swim upwards, and those fish did absolutely nothing for my combo. So I clapped there for nothing. <laughs> And that clam gives me, hey, let me go down, let me, banana, <laughs> banana, <laughs> underwater bananas, I would think that they would get quite rotten by then, this is a current in case you can't see, it pulls you around just like that, it's just as you would expect, and I'm not clapping hard enough again, but I have to keep the sensitivity uh, a lot lower than it was before, because as I said, it was clapping when I didn't want it to clap, and I'll see you guys in just and we're back! I have really got to get a bigger, bigger memory card one of these days. That would make my life so much easier with doing walkthroughs. And oh my god, that reminded me of a blooper! <laughs> that is so weird, doesn't- isn't that- um, Oh wait, I thought I could clap these things to kill them. Maybe- maybe they're like the muncher plants of the DK- wait a sec, DK world. How do I get in there? I forgot how I get in there. Huh. I'd love this. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, am I supposed to? Yeah, I do have to get in there. Hold on a second here. Let me in that. Oh, it's down here. Oh, puffer fish of death. Puffer fish of death. No, no, you've got to go, fishy. Oh, he doesn't die. No way. Let me through, fish. Let me through. Let me through. Gone. Go away. Stop that. Stop moving. There we go. Okay, now we're in a, a sunken ship, evidently, and now there's some jellyfish, and these jellyfish I know I can kill. The, for some reason, these uh, puff themselves up every time I clap near them. That's kind of weird and a little disgusting, I might add. <laughs> now, how the heck do I open these doors? I forgot how to open those doors. Do I throw something at them? I forgot. I don't know. Oh, don't touch those things and they follow you, if I'm not mistaken. What's this thing? Oh, it's a bouncy ball. Are those bouncy balls I could have used the whole way. I wasn't paying attention to the, uh, um, what do you call it? The, oh, hey, whale. All right, there, oh, shoot, I accidentally clapped myself off. Um, there we are. And now he's going to move his way through here. Oh, now he's going to crash through the thingies. Watch, watch, watch. Just like that. Yay! And he's going to kill the fish. And whoo! And there's the pineapple. <laughs> okay, now I remember how to crash through those things. I know there was a way to do it, but I forgot how. 61. And here's the next boss. Looks like it's going to be another 8 versus 8 battle with 683 HP. And oh my god, we're on a log on a raging river. Karate gong! Okay, now he's, he's got a little trickier pattern. Uh, come on, clap, clap, there we go! You want to um, dodge his attack, then hit him on the side that, oh, shoot, and that, hit him on the side that he used his arm with. Like, if he used his left arm, you want to hit him on his left side. Why oh, he's getting ornery! So, dodge, oh, oh, oh! Oh, how do I, how do I dodge that one? I forgot how to, wait, oh! Okay, okay, I got this. Okay, clap time. One, two, three. Uh, yeah, there we go. That's how you do it. Go on, take him down, take him down. Oh, yeah. Okay, you gotta time your claps in that second phase for his kicks. Like, clap your hands each time he kicks, and then you'll be able to dodge it. And as you notice, he sometimes does a little pause, but that pause makes absolutely no difference. But I lost a lot of beats on that battle because I forgot how to beat the boss. Which is too bad, but I got a silver medal. If that's how it's calculated, as I said, I'm pretty sure it is. Because they are uh, marked by those logs. See the little log marker on the right side of that tree trunk? Yeah. 
and movie. Oh, that's a cool combo there. Those guys that I avoided there, you have to hit them like that, and then they'll bounce into each other and create a flurry of bananas. Okay, that's pretty cool.